This is a story about an ordinary teddy bear. When he was made, they found something wrong with him and threw him away like a piece of rubbish into an old dark storeroom. Then, from outer space, a spotty man brought him to life with his cosmic dust. He took him to a magic cloud where Mother Nature gave him special powers. That bear became Super Ted. In the black void of space, circling a tiny sun, is a small but very beautiful planet. Towards it flies an alien rocket carrying a spotty man to see his best friend. There it is, the planet Earth. It'll be good to see Super Ted again. Uh, he may look strange and hairy, but, but he's the best friend that I... Uh, 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 hey, what's that? Oh, my lovely rocket. It's got the staggers. Ah! Meanwhile, on the surface of the planet... Hmm. I wonder, should I wear something different today? That sounds like Spotty. I think he's in trouble again. I, I think I'm in trouble again. My rocket's got the staggers. Uh, I'm going to crash. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you receiving me? Come in, please. Oh, great moons of Spot. Pulsating prunes. The radio's gone dead. Hmm. Now, by my calculations, the signal was coming from somewhere over North America, but where? I'd better say my magic word. Super Jet can't have got my message. No, I think I've had it. Unless I can find the right spot. Ah! Speckled sons of Spot. Oh, don't come any closer. I, I'm not here. Help! Oh. Oh. No, no. Oh. Oh. oh, a spotty Earth Man. Oh. A beautiful, blotchy, speckledy, freckledy Earth Man. Oh. 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 Why did we have to bring such a big gun, Tex? It's so heavy. My bones ache. Because we're going to shoot buffalo, that's why. Tonight we's going to eat buffalo steak. <laughs> big, big Spot. <laughs> you, can, you can call me Spotty. Big Spot and Spotty become Blood Spot Brothers. Blood? Oh, oh dear. Smoke pipe of peace in honor of Spotted Buffalo, sacred beast of Spotted Feather Tribe. Smoke pipe of peace? Well, I'll try anything once. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, not far away... No, I'm not going to carry this gun a step further. Put your end down, Bulk. Oh, all right, Skelly. Pick up that rifle before I wrap it round your skull. We were only having a little rest. My feet are killing me. I'll be killing you if you don't pick up that gun. All right, big bully. Go on, Bulk. Pick your end up. Uh, ma, ma. We swear friendship on sacred shield of spotted buffalo. Ah! <laughs> Sounded like a gunshot. Galloping gooseberries! That looks like Spotty's rocket. I'd better investigate. Okay, Bulk. Hold your breath. Right you are, Tex. <gasps> I can taste that juicy buffalo steak already. Bulk! Are you holding your breath? <laughs> Look, two pale faces and bone man. 
Yes, it's Texas Pete, bulk and skeleton. I think they're after the sacred buffalo. Don't worry, I've got you. No, I haven't. Seems a shame to waste a good bullet on a mangy ball of stuffing. You won't get away that easily, Texas Pete. <laughs> getting slow in your old age, Tex. Not too slow for a two-bit teddy. Ah! Oh, bubbling gooseberries. What hit me? Any famous last words, Super Ted? Because your stuffing's gonna be scattered in the wind. You won't get away with this. Huh. I expected something a little more original, like Please let me go. I'll never chase you again. <laughs> Bye-bye, Super <laughs> Hey, what's the big idea? Hold me down! Ah, that's where that arrow went to. Thanks, Spotty. I didn't realize you knew how to use a bow and arrow. Oh, yes. Um, I pick up these things very easily. But you say you aim at a Russian brook. Shh! I'm almost sorry we managed to repair your rocket ship, Spotty. I was beginning to enjoy myself. Look, Spotty, smoke signals. What on spot does that mean? <laughs> it's your rocket trail, Spotty. He thinks it's making smoke signals. <laughs> <laughs>